Okay, this is the final piece of the sand and the slurry. Pump it into the backyard device. Basically what it is is a uh, simple valve. Closes and opens according to changes in water pressure. Right now it's closed. You can see that it's primed. It's leaking a little bit of water. When I start to pump, the pressure will build up. That plate should swing up. The wheel on the left should roll back. That will transfer the center of gravity beyond the hinge point and help it stay up. That little set screw, bottom right, prevents it from swinging up so far that it uh, stays open. The little spring will give it a little tiny gentle shove to close it when I run out of water. What I'm going to do is go out here, I'm going to start the pump, let it run, get a prime going, kick the thing up let it flow for about half a minute running full force I'll shut the pump off it'll drop down I'll shut, start the pump up hopefully it'll open up again and that'll simulate the pit running out of water and then filling back up again uh, it's got some counterbalances up there in the top right which is adjustable so that when I move it to the backyard my uh, water pressure changes I can adjust it to for a good trigger point and let's see what happens. You should see the water start building up pressure. Usually takes about 20 seconds and you'll see the uh, water coming out of the bottom there starts to increase. Come on, you can do it. What happens is there's air in that line. I've got about 70 feet of pipe between here and the pit. And any bubbles that are in there tend to expand a lot. So you need to basically flush the line out of any air. Okay, the pressure's starting to build up. You can hear a load starting to pick up on the motor. Now it's really building it up. It should start moving. It usually takes about two or three bounces to get it all the way up. That's actually sand coming out now. It's trying. Okay, and it's up. Staying up. That's basically a valve wide open. I'm going to shut the pump off just for a second. Let it drop back down then start it up again see if it restarts kicked it right back open I put a little soap in there for effect. <laughs> 